Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. Uh, and today we are driving into an almost deserted central London. So we should start this episode by saying do not travel unless you absolutely have to. Yeah, stay at home guys. We are on this trip partly to drop off some video conferencing equipment to people who don't have it so they can stay in touch with their loved ones and partly to restock my parents' groceries because my parents are in lockdown due to being vulnerable. But also we need groceries. We're running out of food. We've asked around some people in our community as well and we're just going to do one big grocery run. Buy everyone some food. And uh, hopefully we don't get accused of hoarding. <laughs> <laughs> don't hoard. Yeah. We're buying what's necessary so that people can stay at home and don't have to keep coming out to supermarkets because let's just try and minimize that. It's literally the beginning of spring. This is probably the first week of nice weather we've had all year. It's amazing how sunny it is. Uh, and yet everyone has to stay home. So yeah, we're feeling it. You know what's a weird thing? I've driven around central London a lot, right? Yeah. I have never had to watch the speed that I'm going. It's impossible There's to go over the speed so limit. There's so much traffic. If you're just, you're never ever gonna go over the speed limit. Mental. That ordinarily would be completely wrapped. There's no cars. We're in central Kensington right now and there is nothing. I mean, this is crazy. This is like this a is ghost Kensington. Town. So weird. This is Natural History Museum coming up on our left. No people. This street is completely empty. Wow, that is so surreal. Look at that, Natural History Museum, gates closed. Never seen this. Completely closed, not a soul around. It's like a movie, like not a happy movie. We're literally living in a disaster movie. We're living in pandemic, except it's not a board game. It's reality. This is like Tourist Central, Victoria and Albert Museum. Doors shut, nobody around. Normally these roads are oh shock a block. Gosh, this is Harrods up Is that here. Harrods? Wow, no one. Probably the most iconic, famous mall in the UK. In theory, it shouldn't be surprising. This is what it should be like. We shouldn't be seeing people out shopping, but just seeing it with your own two eyes is something else. This kind of creeps me out a bit. Yeah. You know? Yeah, it's weird. This is Buckingham Palace Gardens on the right, where the Queen lives. Oh, wow, yeah. Holy moly. Oh, the flag's up. The Queen's in. God bless the Queen. Oh, the guards are still out, the though. flag. Look how empty it is, though. No tourists, no Holy nothing. Holy crap. Pal Mal, the, the, the Mal was completely empty. Buckingham Palace, no one outside. I think the last time we went down the Mall in one of our videos was in like our third ever video. Cycling. Fourth ever video, yeah. Wow. Cycling around London, introducing the parks. Simpler times. The parks of London that are now closed. Yeah, those are simpler times. Like central London around here, this is normally literally so busy. Like if you're walking on the pavement, you have to shove your way through crowds. You have to maneuver around people. And yeah, right now there's almost no one. It feels like there's just a few people who like just been living under a rock, like haven't got the news. <laughs> they're just like don't watch TV. They have, they have no idea what's going on. They're just there's walking around. Like, why is it so empty in London? <laughs> the buses seem to be fully operational. Buses? They're also like almost all empty. I guess they're just mainly operating for mornings and evenings when NHS workers are coming and going. Yeah. Things like that. This is honestly crazy, dude. Yeah, man. I've lived in London my whole life, and yeah. I've never seen anything like this. Yeah. Wow, look at this road. Yeah, Westminster Abbey on the right. Flip, look at that. No, not a tourist in sight. Wow. This is insane. This is... This is absolutely insane. Nuts. There's no one anywhere. It's Parliament Square, isn't it? Westminster Square? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Holy moly. Oh my gosh. One solitary cyclist. Half of the cars the here are police cars. cars. Yeah. 10 Downing Street is just ahead here. Yeah. And there's no one. <laughs> That's Downing Street. There's not a soul. Just guards. Wow. This is the heart of central London and it is deserted. Wait, we're coming up on Trafalgar Square. I guess we keep saying it's tourist central, but this is flipping. It doesn't really get more central than this. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Not a soul. A dirty window. No one. Anywhere. That 
is a deserted Trafalgar Square. This is Covent Garden. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, look at this. The road between Covent Garden and Leicester Square. It's normally Rano. Uh, that's that's Leicester Square moly, up ahead. That, that, that right there. Empty. <sighs> Chinatown. No one. This, I feel like this video is going to get very repetitive, but it's insane. That's flipping nuts. This is Piccadilly Circus. Wow, it's completely empty. Regent Street, just a couple of buses, and that is it. I don't really know what to say. <laughs> I'd be interested to know from you guys watching what your cities are like. Yeah, I'm because really curious, yeah. I think what's so crazy about this for us is the familiarity of it. It's like, this is a place that we know really well but we've never seen it like this. It's a bit like the first day after it snows a lot. The entire world is the same, but it looks completely different. Except that that's like a magically exciting time, and this yeah. is kind of just terrifying. It brings home the reality of the situation. Every single one of these roads we've driven down should just be so busy. Heaving with people, yeah. That's Oxford Street. I know, flipping heck. All right, we're just dropping off some things with our friend. So good to see Thanks, you. Sir. I'll tell How you, you but right? yeah, 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 good. We're all right. Missing you, bro. All right, see you. Take care of yourself, yeah. So yeah, it just like really brings home how the severity of the situation. If like a global city like London can be brought to its yeah. knees like this, you know, we all need to be taking it seriously. And yeah. Washing the heck out of our hands. <laughs> <laughs> just like being safe, you know. When you go to places outside. If you have to, then stay away from people. Stay separate from people and try not to leave the house unless you absolutely necessary. Yeah, we need to flatten that curve and slow this the crap down. Yeah, because it's, uh, it's a total b coronavirus. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> Arriving to go pick up some supplies. It looks like it's open. It looks yeah. also like there isn't a queue, which is really good. Because we've seen quite a lot of supermarkets had queues to get in. Presumably so many people were trying to go there to stock up that they had to limit the amount of people that came in. Gloves. All right, guys, we're gonna go get some groceries. It's weird how familiar we've got with all of this stuff, you know? Yeah, like, it's just, it's just presumed If I now. saw one of these before last month, I'd probably be thinking I'm either about to have a colonoscopy. Oh, God. Or you're about to go commit a crime. Or or about to commit a crime, or yeah. maybe I'm really unfortunate and I've been selected for a random screening in the airport. Oh gosh, that's, that, that's, that's bad. Because that's these bad. gloves are designed to go places. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Everyone's All thinking right, it, Josh. Alrighty, so we just dropped off stuff at my parents. We obviously didn't film that because their privacy. <laughs> privacy, guys, privacy. Not that any of you should but... be going out at all, yeah, I mean, it wouldn't but make any you, difference because you all need to stay home. If you do happen to go out, we don't want you congregating outside my parents' house for some reason. <laughs> I don't know why you do that, Jolly Beans, but we just don't want it. And we don't want to tempt you, you know? If we, if no, we let temptation. you know where they live, at least it's a temptation. <laughs> so really, we're doing you all a favor. <laughs> okay, okay. You're welcome, Jolly Beans. <laughs> all right, well, uh, that has been our little adventure outside of the house in London. I, not much has happened other than us saying over and over again. I can't believe how few people there are. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, that's an epic viral video. I hope you guys Look enjoy. at this empty street. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we'll see you jolly soon. We'll see you jolly soon. Bye. Bye.